The Cleveland Cultural Gardens are unique in the world. The central theme has always been peace through mutual understanding. At this time, I'd like to introduce Paul Burke, President of the Cleveland Cultural Garden Federation, for a welcome on behalf of the Cleveland Cultural Garden Federation. Paul. Distinguished officials, honored guests, friends of the gardens, it's my uh, true pleasure to welcome you to the Rockefeller Park in the Cleveland Cultural Gardens. And especially, uh, it, it, it's my true pleasure to welcome the Serbian community to their new garden. I know that there are voices within your community that, that wanted to build this garden elsewhere, out in the suburbs. And, and I suppose if you want to stand alone and not be part of the uh, uh, movement of nations, then that's what you would strive for. But I'm glad that the uh, majority prevailed and that the Serbian community came and joined the Cleveland Cultural Gardens and the nationalities and elected to build their garden here in, Rockefeller, in the city's Rockefeller Park and join the 26 gardens uh, in pursuing peace through mutual understanding. I welcome you. We have a great site here with Martin Luther Drive right behind us where hundreds if not thousands will see your garden daily. You have a great opportunity to uh, express your, um, uh, portray your, your significant personalities in your history and express your culture right here in the uh, Rockefeller Park. Thank you for your efforts. I know it was a great challenge. I commend your community and Alex and Lex Mcheski for the effort. I drove by just Friday and I know none of the statues were up, so awful lot has happened since uh, last Friday. That's how construction goes. It's the last minute effort. I'm happy and I'm glad that we have a great day. And again, welcome to the uh, Cleveland Cultural Gardens. Thank you. Getting the um, King Peter the First statue here was easy because we made arrangements to buy that one months ago. And through the wonderful kindness of Matt Rebovich, who created and donated the Nikola Tesla statue. We had that one in hand a long time ago. But getting the one of Bishop uh, Negosh and Michael Pupin, uh, that took some doing because a week ago they were still in Belgrade. But we got them here, got them through customs. Moreover, the pedestals came from China and they just came in three days ago. So you talk about it all coming together at the very end. Follow Volga, thank God that it did. And I'd like to acknowledge Matt Reprovic. Matt, please stand for your wonderful contribution. 